Hello everyone, this is Geneva again with another version of the Creepy Coffin Scrapbook Mini designed by Laura Dennison. If you go to follow the paper trail with Laura.com, and I will put the link below in the description, um, you can purchase this and other fabulous patterns from Laura to create beautiful and other projects like this one. This particular pattern sells for $10. On the front, um, I took a big skull that I got from Michael's and just cut the back of the head off to place it on the uh, tombstone. The tombstone is cut from the Happy Hauntings Cricket cartridge, as is the spooky uh, black spider, kind of creepy netting. The trim pieces on the side are created by me. The part that looks like um, rivets is actually glue that I dotted and let dried overnight, covered in black alcohol ink, attached to the strips and painted everything black and adhered to the box. The spine's got ribbons and keys and metal charms on it. The inside, as you can see, is a um, creepy skeleton figure covered in uck. Um, held down by two big skeleton hands. There's a big uh, black widow type spider in there. The spine I decorated with cutouts from the paper um, that I used, which was a combination of a K and Company 2012 Halloween paper that I got at Michael's, as well as a Michael's Recollections brand, um, The Haunted Mansion. There are six total pages. Each page has four places for photos, journaling, whatever you like. Um, each page has um, an area to put tags in. I cut them out in the shapes of tombstones and coffins. I ran the um, tag holder down the side rather than across the top so the tags could be bigger. had a lot of fun putting the album together. The bat there has uh, red rhinestone eyes. The um, frames, extra mats, were cut again from the Happy Hauntings cartridge on my Cricut machine. The edging for the um, extra tag holders is different um, Fiskars edge punches. This turned out pretty, pretty neat. Um, Thanks again to Laura Dennison for her design of the uh, mini album. This particular edging um, I created myself. I have scowl and um, I use it a lot. The fence down there with the cat and the raven, I created that one as well. Lots more tags. Again, the, the words are from the Happy Hauntings cartridge from Cricut. The inside of the back cover, um, again I cut these shapes out using my Cricut machine. Uh, uh, a holiday cartridge for the hearth, um, Victorian something for the chairs and the rug. I highlighted it with uh, green embossing powder. came out pretty cool. Looks like the green spooky fire glowing off of the rugs and the furniture. Hope you enjoyed looking at this as much as I did making it. Thank you everybody and happy Halloween.